In this video, I am going to show you how to make an animated tick mark like this. You may often see these types of animation in mobile applications when a particular task is performed successfully. Here I am going to use it from Express and no other third party tool. So let's see how it looks. So as you can see we are on HitFilm Express. So first of all let's make a composite shot. So I am going to make here the duration of 5 seconds only. Since this is only the animation. And let's make a plane layer first. So I am going to use the green color since our tick mark has a green color. So it's okay. So you can see this is a simple plane. But our animation has a green outline circle. So we have to make it first of all a circle. So to do that just apply an effect called polar wrap effect so here is the effect and you just apply so after applying this effect you can see our plane layer turns into a circle but this is a fill circle we need an outline circle so how to do that so here you can see there are two properties one is start radius another is end radius you just increase the start radius here and you can see gradually our fill circle turns into an outline circle I think this much is sufficient. So this is our complete circle. So now we have to apply the animation here. Now to make an animation, you can see there are two properties. One is rotation, another is range. First of all, let's change the range to 0 from 180, from 180 and apply the keyframe. So after few frames, you just change the keyframe to 180 again for both the properties. So here you can see our animation is properly applied but here the animation is in the clockwise direction but we need the animation in anti-clockwise direction that means like this so how to do that so it's very simple So now the animation is in anti-clockwise direction. Now to make the animation more smooth, just select all the keyframe and apply the manual bezier effect. So manual bezier effect is basically is used to make an animation smooth. So our first part is done. Now we have to make the tick mark here. So for that purpose, just select a plane layer and just name it as a say tick 1 and change the scale you should also change the anchor point so our concept is first of all the circle should complete and then the tick mark will appear that means our tick mark should start from here Now I am going to apply the animation for this particular tick mark. Activate the keyframe and then after a few frames just make it 10. Now let's make a duplicate of this particular plane. So I'm going to remove these old animations here. So basically the second part of the tick mark starts from here because first part starts from here and here it is completed and then the second part starts. That's why I have shortened this part. Now activate the keyframe for animation. So I think it's done. Since this is a complete composite shot so you can apply this animation in anywhere like any video or any image so i'm showing you how so i'm going to combine to make one composite shot here so here you can see this is a complete composite shot and now i'm going to here adjust the scale i can make it 3d also So 
So after applying some sound effect, the final output becomes like this. So that's it for today. I hope you have got to learn something new. Then hit the like button, leave your comments and share it. And don't forget to subscribe my channel and press the bell icon. I will see you in the next video.